I like my math rocks. Math rocks go click clack. Yo, it's a Abby. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. If you're returning, welcome back to my channel. I play Dungeons and Dragons every Sunday with my group that I've had since five years, which is crazy to think of. Today, I'm going to show you all of my current Dungeons and Dragons dice. It is set Actually, it's October. I'll show you my current collection. I'm gonna turn on this light for a little ambiance and let's get started. Okay, first off, we have this set, which I actually got from one of the players. It was from a like older D&D because &D, I came in like during 5e, but you can see some of these dice are really cool. Like this one is a D24, I think and it has all of these sides, which is so cool. We have a bunch of other ones that are just interesting. I have some light up dice, and these are not rechargeable, so I only light them up on very special occasions, which we can say is now. <laughs> Why isn't this one, did this one die? Oh, there we go. See, it lights up. All of them light up, and I'm just gonna show you that one. <laughs> Next, we have Foam Brain Games. It's beautiful like multi-shift color dice. I don't know if it's shifting. I think this just has like this, I don't know how to explain this look, but it has purple, green, blue. It looks almost like it changes each time you turn it around. I was actually filming a elf cosplay, and so that's why I'm in this like attire. I thought it looked really cute. I love metal dice. It's the sound that they make when you're rolling them. It's just like, ugh. It scratches my brain. Then in my dice jail, I have the first dice that I ever got. This is what it looks like. This is when I very first started playing Dungeons and Dragons. This one was being very bad, so I put it in dice jail. <laughs> then I have this chess X, which I actually got for probably like my birthday or some holiday from my D and D group. They've given me a lot of my dice, so I'm very appreciative of them. They're so pretty. I wonder if I can get like more of these just boxes so I can put each of my dice in them. I got another set from one of the players from my group and it came with this D4 potion bottle. And this is what this set looks like. It is blue and purple. I also have my first set of metal dice. It's like this bronze looking color. I have just a ton of D6s because I used to play a druid, wood elf, and I needed all the D6s for when I conjured animals. I have some dice in this bag. This is another set of metal dice that I actually got on Amazon, and it is this beautiful black and gold. So that looks like my glasses keep slipping. Glasses are so cute though. They're from Furmu, and they like have this natural blush tint on them. So it looks like you're always blushing. <laughs> There's the other die. <laughs> this is not supposed to be here. It's supposed to be with this set. And I have this pink and purple set. It came in this bag. Here is the rest of the first white set that I got. Let's let these dice look close up. I almost forgot my other dice. Here I have two set of cat dice. This one is from D&D Dice. It comes with a cat poker chip, which is super cute. It has a heads and I just call this tails. And then this is what it looks like. It has little cat ears on the numbers, which is super cute. The D6 has little fish bones on it. And it has a cat face. It is purple and clear and it sometimes when you look at it, it has like a little iridescent type of look to it. If that's the right word. The D20 is a little cat face. Can you see that? There you go. That's one of my cat dice set. <laughs> I really like this one because it comes with a couple of D6s too. This is my most recent cat dice set. And this one comes with a little cat inside of each of the dice. I hope you can see the little kitty in there. This was an impulse buy at a convention <laughs> where I said I wasn't going to buy any more dice. This is probably my most expensive pair. This is the Mystic Dragon set. It is a metal dice. The edges are actually really sharp and you can see there's little dragons on them. And again, I don't know what it is about this color where it like shifts from like blue to green that I really like, but I really like these ones. Yeah, it's super cool. Each of the numbers you can see has like a little dragon. This was just a dice that they had on the side, but it's the same like color, whatever this is. I gotta figure out what this is called. Yeah, this is what it looks like. Actually, like my knives that I have in my kitchen are the same color. <laughs> so I don't know what it's called. It's just whenever I see it, I call it like dragon breath because I don't know the name of the color. <laughs> yeah, 
that's all my Dungeons and Dragon dice for now, at least October of 2023. I'll return to make a new video once I get some more dice. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and want to see more Dungeons and Dragons content. Hope you enjoyed this video. Okay, bye!